an unfinished paint job drawing all sorts of attention in Sussex. As Ben Jordan reports, a partial coat of primer on the town's water tower revealed, shall we say, a short declarative <laughs> fraction of the word Sussex. Within the past couple of hours, painters took care of the X, but before they did, plenty of drivers stopped by to take pictures for evidence. Just driving by. And it's hard to imagine a water tower ever garnering this much attention. Couldn't help but miss this, uh, the water tower. Some call it the new unofficial tourist destination in Sussex. Why didn't they start with sus? But I'm glad that they didn't. <laughs> It's hilarious. Although not everyone is laughing. Actually, I wasn't the one that noticed it. So it was my eight year old son in the back seat nonetheless. Jessica Bruss says it led to a conversation she wasn't ready to have. The very first question he asked me was, Mom, does that say sex? The contractor behind the paint job says it wasn't their initial intention. We had a starting point on top of the tank. Jesse Sheets claims it was due to a venting issue. We started in a circle and had to stop to let the paint dry. When do you ever get a chance to paint sex on a water tower? Bruss says she leaves with one takeaway. Our children are seeing words and being influenced by things that we don't even notice. The contractor tells us the new Sussex logo will be on this water tower by sometime next week. It will surely have the town's full name. Reporting in Sussex, Ben Jordan, today's TMJ4. It certainly makes for some good fodder though, that's for sure. Thank you, Ben.